What's up nerds on a Renegade Cactus, but you can call me whatever you want. Welcome back to God of Weapons. <coughs> I am still in the, in the act of recovery, basically. But I am feeling good, I'm feeling great even, so let's jump in. We got the Raven, who's a rogue, or we got the Hunter. Both that we have not yet tried, right? We started with the Knight, we went with the Barbarian, or did we start with the Hunter? Did we start with the hunter? No, no, we did not. Did we go with the raven? Starting weapons. Yeah, we did. Okay, uh, <laughs> so we have not played the knight yet or the hunter. Knight, media power, vitality, resource gain. Weapon master, attack speed for every unique weapon. Attacks, minus 50% attack speed, cannot equip ranged weapon, and plus 15% item prices. Or the eldritch knight. Five armor, one magic power for each two armor. You know, Eldritch Knight sounds really fun. Ooh, that's a lot of good, uh, cool starting weapons. Short sword, uh, we could. Long sword, we could. Prism blade. Okay, okay, that's a lot to read. <clears throat> okay, these use melee. This one uses your magic attack. Chance to deal additional fire or ice damage. Ice damage applies cold. Fire damage sets enemies on fire over three seconds. Increased chance to deal additional damage by 7% for each adjacent enchanted weapon. Interesting. Deal burning damage. Flail attacks cause a burst of spikes. Or the magic staff. Fire a beam of piercing magic. Adjacent magic power items grant plus 2 magic power. You know what? That sounds fun. We are a knight, but I don't really care. Starting items, Tattered Banner, adjacent weapons give plus 3 armor, adjacent armor items give plus 3 melee power. Interesting. Difficulty, let's start with... You know what? Screw it. Let's go with 2. Uh, wait. <coughs> we wanna go... No, where, where, where are we going again? <laughs> why, why am I the way I am? Was it here? Oh yeah, of course, it's the tower entrance. Okay. Okay, I'm I'm listening. That is a pretty cool weapon, not gonna lie. So basically, we want to get as much as much uh, what's it called? Defense or armor as possible because that also increases our attacks, right? Okay, level up. Let's go with this, this, that, something. Adjacent weapons give plus three armor. Adjacent armor items give plus three melee power. Fire maze. That one burns. Move speed. Black ebony dagger. Okay, let's see. We could go for a fire maze that would just take all of this. Wait, how much do you need? Three, okay. 5% resource gain, or we could go, you know what? Why not? Why not take the maze, right? And why not take resource gain <coughs> and just go? So technically, oh, <coughs> I'm sorry, my voice is already a bit, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm still recovering from some throat problems once again. Uh, I mean, I, th I think I got the, the better end of the stick because the two of my colleagues have been have been on sick leave for two weeks now. And at least one of them, I know, uh, has bronchitis. So just a little throat ache with a bit of a cough is definitely something that I much rather have. Ooh, another fire maze. <laughs> so, thing is, we want... Does it tell me? Yes. Plus five armor, one magic power for each two armor, one melee power for each two armor. So the more armor we get, the better, especially since armor modifications are 25% more effective. So I want magic and melee. I can't do range anyway, so that doesn't really matter. And every weapon gives plus three armor when it's adjacent here. And every armor item gives melee power, so that's also pretty dang good. Okay, I don't think... Wait. We can. We can just go 
or a sword like this, which means we now have more armor, which also means we now have more magic and midi power. That is cool. That is a really interesting playstyle, I feel like. Just a very magical midi attacker. Although, I mean, I know the staff is a magic weapon. It doesn't count as a ranged weapon, although its range is basically unlimited, and I love it. Yeah, generally, in, in most games, like in, uh, let's say, MMOs, I prefer... I prefer um, classes that can go both ranged and melee, that don't get, that's called a shoehorned in one, in only one single direction. Okay, I don't know if that was a good idea right now, what I just did, but hey, we'll see. Let's go for more resources, why not? I could have used a claw. Hmm. Only going for claws would also be interesting because every time you kill 50 enemies with with this weapon, does that mean this weapon specifically, like if you had 10 claws, let's say, or 5 claws, does it count if all 5 of them together kill 50 enemies because it's this weapon? Or is it this weapon specifically, like this weapon specifically does have to kill 50 and another claw also has to kill 50? I'm not sure. <coughs> Let's reroll once, see what we can get. Fire wand. Shoot three fire bolts that deal burning damage. Okay. You know what? That sounds fun. Let's lock it. Consumed, restore 40% health. Don't care. Attack speed minus one armor. We do not want to go for minus armor. Ice wand. Attack with ice projectiles. Ice sphere grows 10% archer for each adjacent enchanted weapon. Do we have an enchanted? Yes, we do. We have two enchanted weapons. Interesting. Luck, crit chance, attack speed now. Now let's go with what we have. <laughs> also, like with this magic wand, I definitely, definitely want to go for a magic wand only run at some point. Like only this wand and nothing else because I feel like <clears throat> just shooting these lasers in all directions at any point in the game just sounds really fun, right? It's not just me. It just being a death laser mage type of deal. Maybe even with this um, Eldritch Knight because we just want some survivability as well. Okay, I want this. I want that. Um, let's say I want something up here. I don't know why, but let's just say I do. All right, we can, we cannot go for the ice wand. We can go for the fire wand. And what we can do is just put this over here, this over there, and now every single weapon meets this one. So, right, yeah, that's minus four armor. And with this, that's plus four armor. That's pretty good. This one doesn't get increased by anything with enchanted, so yeah, this is the only one. Gotcha. Range, minus dodge chance, don't care really. Experience gain, minus resource gain. I want that because we have plus... Wait, how much do you need? Two. Oh, I can do this. We had plus 10% resource gain, now it's minus three. So yeah, we're at seven, that's completely fine by me. Okay, okay, okay. I see, I see. The fireballs are pretty much exactly what I thought they would be. <clears throat> we don't have any any way of self-healing so far. That's one thing we're missing. We just got... I think we got some health? No, there was a level up. That's it. I'm thinking if we could get some lifesteal... Oh, that was healing. If you could get some lifesteal, even if it's a few percent, the beam, the f Ooh. <clears throat> sorry. Oh, yeah, uh, level up. Uh, let's go with something along those lines. Because now I can do this. 
Got another one of these, and if I get another one, then I can combine. And that's pretty cool. Magic power, projectile power, minus recovery. The one magic power, in my opinion, doesn't really... Doesn't sound amazing. Also, if I were to do this... Okay, that's what I thought. I had to try it for science. <coughs> so everything that's not inside my inventory gets destroyed. I don't have basically one slot that I can use for anything to keep. No, I have to have everything in the inventory. That's what makes this game way harder because like if you want to upgrade stuff, oh my goodness. I don't have any in invincibility frames. Like if I run into an enemy and they keep running into me like they just did multiple times, I just take damage every single time. I'm at one health. Four, three, two, whoa, okay, come on. <clears throat> okay. We need to re-roll for health. There is no other way. Ooh, a sickle with lifesteal. That is something that I really need. But the problem is I don't have... Oh yeah, well, wait, wait, no? Do I? If I were to do this, I still couldn't use that. Shit. If I were to go like this... Does anything change? Yes, a little bit. All right, all right. So that's at least some lifesteal. Plus 15% lifesteal, if not near any other lifestealing weapon. Okay, okay. Um, MIDI power, attack speed. Oh, that would be great. You know what? Let's put it here for now. Give me a second. Unlock this. I don't really... Ooh, that looks cool. Crimson Rapier. Do we have space for that? No. It has lifesteal. 15%. If we were to get rid of the short sword, we, were, we still would be missing one space. Here's the problem. I can't change anything around here, but I kind of really need it. I think... What I'm going to do is I'm going to sell the fire maze. Ah, but damn it. Now this loses the 15% lifesteal. Wait a second, wait a second. I, I'm sure I can do this. You have five, right? Here. Damn it. Uh, is there any way to change things around here? Let's let's just keep going and see. I mean, how much crit, uh, how much life steal? Still eleven percent on its own. So even if I don't do anything, ah, oh, that sucks. Oh, this sucks. All right, all right. Experience gain, yada yada. Crit chance, attack speed, assassin's glove would be fun. But I really just need something. Life steal 1%, dodge chance. Oh, damn. Oh, there was melee and magic power. That would be great. 4% life steal minus 2%. Let's sell this. I don't really care. So many cool things, but I just, what I'm looking for right now is just the healing potion. I know that I'll have to get rid of something. I step percent item price. That would be cool. Problem is, if I just keep re-rolling like this, I'm just gonna lose it. Yeah, screw it. Ooh. Yeah, whatever. We are on one health. We might just go down right now. There is a high chance. Wait. I life stole a little bit. I stealed the life. 
I'm maneuvering myself into an impossible corner. That's not good. I need some help. Just some more healing. An item of some kind. That is an A. That looks like it would heal me because it has a cross on it. But no, it's just a level up. Wait, wait. We are somehow living. We are invulnerable. Oh my goodness, I actually... Damn! And we're up to 25. Okay. Okay! Damn it. <laughs> but I can do it like this now. So these don't touch and I have more lifesteal. I want this sickle. I do. Problem is... I can't really use it. This one takes five as well. I mean, I could get rid of one of my fire wands for a better fire wand. I just kind of right now want to keep them around in case I roll another fire. Ooh. You know what? What if I were to sell this and buy this? You know? It's just, it's just, it's just a thing that I could do. Uh, we locked this one. There it is. All right, all right. Uh, do we want something? Ooh, that would give me armor. Finally, something with armor. Great sword. Plus six vitality for each adjacent sword. Oh, that would be. Oh, that would be interesting. That would be good, even. <laughs> Melee power, magic power. Oh. Ooh, that one's good. Okay. Let's sell this. Let's buy that. Unlock this. Technically really good, I know. Um, it's technically even better like this. I think. Okay. For each adjacent melee weapon and for each adjacent enchanted weapon. Yeah, so that's plus four. Or now that's pretty dang good all right 25 health we do have two swords with really good um, what's it called lifesteal right so now we just have to hit with said swords in order to steal some life damn it and not run into enemies like crazy like I keep doing Yeah, the, the, the lack of invulnerability frames, ooh, or invincibility frames, sorry, is what's killing me, like literally killing me. More health, that's great, that's great. We are living. We are actually living. We're full health again. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that is pretty nice. Okay, so what if, you know, what if I just did some stuff? What if I were to get rid of this? If I were to put this here, one, two, three, four, five, you take six, right? Yeah. Chastened weapons, chastened weapons has an extra 20% to trigger lifesteal on kill. Huh. Okay, interesting. Let's see. First of all, let's sell the sword. I, if I had one more, I could get this. I could probably build around. Wait, could I just switch some stuff around? The answer is yes. Yes, I could. Uh, you know what? Don't really care for the fire maze. Oh, I did not use this. <laughs> I, I did not use. I did not use this. I thought this was automatically, but no, no, it wasn't. Um, if I were to just sell this, I could get this. Put it here. Yeah, doesn't really matter how. I think. Um, this now hits still four weapons. That's pretty cool. I could put it up here. Wait. If I were to do this, like so, how many weapons would I hit? One, two, three, four, five. That's more. 
that's definitely more. Armor of 23. This thing goes here. I think we're good. For now. So some of my weapons, and I did not really take a look at what or which ones, have a bonus to lifesteal on kill. So usually lifesteal is if you hit an enemy, there is a chance that you get one life. Lifesteal on kill is pretty much exactly what it what it's uh, what it, the name implies. If you kill something, there is a chance you get a life. I think it's again one life, one HP. Shouldn't use or shouldn't get the meat every time it appears. I should keep it around. I don't know if it just. I don't know if it stays around or if it goes away after some time. It looks like it stays around for the turn. Okay, great. Uh, I don't know. I just want more stuff back here. A great axe. That would probably be really cool. But I would have to get rid of so many things. Don't really wanna. Um, now, I could. If I find another... Hmm. Ooh, another Crimson Dagger that would actually be useful, I think. Wait, is there a way to... No, I can't get that one in any way. I could get rid of some things here. Adjacent weapons. Okay, so these two weapons have bonus to lifesteal on kill. Interesting. Projectile power, we don't care for that. Experience gain, sure. You know what? Screw this. It takes too much. Uh, resource gain, yeah, let's just take it for now. We can get put it away if need be. Um. Oh yeah, adjacent magic power items grant plus one magic power. Totally forgot about that. That's a, wait. Five, plus five magic power, plus four melee power. And if I put it here, plus five melee power, plus nine magic power. Oh yeah, uh, that's cool. That's really cool. Armor, ooh, plus four armor. That just gave us plus five armor because of our, because of our bonus things, whatever. I, I really want another magic staff. I really want the ice wands. Another fire mace. Ooh, another blue one. I would need three spaces. Do I have three spaces somehow? Could get rid of the helmet. Could get rid of just, you know what? Screw it. Get rid of 4% life, life steal. Just for this. Now, if I were to... I couldn't put this anywhere else. Okay, okay. Getting the hang of this game. <laughs> Getting the hang of this game, I think. I am a turret, but I still have midi damage, so I'm... I'm... What hit me? Okay, that was some... Oh, okay, yeah, sure. Uh, that's some heat-seeking missiles or whatever. I... Oh, we're at floor 10, so that's probably some kind of mini-boss, right? Where is it? Okay, there it is. Can we somehow please hit it and kill it? Maybe? No? Yeah, I think we did. I heard some death cry, kinda. Got some health. Awesome. Like, the problem is we do have a lot of armor, which means we don't take a whole lot of damage. But we don't really have a whole lot of health. Or at least it feels like it. Like, we... Once we take damage, we we just keep taking damage. Is the problem. Five level ups, that's good. Um where I think maybe something like this. Don't know if it's a good idea. Wait, yes, that's a oh my goodness. Oh that's good. We have six up here, so now we could do some stuff. Definitely could do some stuff. Midi power armor minus lifesteal. Hmm. No, thank you. Uh, block. No, thank you. 
projectile power no thank you <clears throat> resource gain i'm just gonna buy it for now i can get rid of it if i want to projectile power again no thank you midi power attack speed we're gonna take it again can get rid of it if i want to fire wand a gray one okay so if i were to put this here put this up here now i can combine three of them and have another blue fire wand if i find another blue of them now then we are pretty much good okay what are you prison blade oh yeah cold and fire that sounds quite nice this one is a cool weapon, but the problem is it is only tier 1 and we have two, two tier 2 weapons. Let's lock this for now. I was about to say, oh, we got it again, but no, I just locked it. So, <laughs> we need to heal? No, definitely not. What is you? Critical chance by 5, but vitality minus? No, thank you. Ah, again, I mean, we can still take it. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, yeah, I miscalculated but if i were to do this I'm, I'm just gonna take it for now and if we find something more interesting i mean i, I how can i not right how can i not move speed life steal that's not bad one one more time Ooh. screw this okay Good thing is, oh, that, okay, we just took damage. We now have two lasers, and already that looks fun. Like I said, if we were to have like six of them, I think six of them and then just increase our attack speed if possible. That sounds like something that I really want to try. Not today. Today I'm just trying to survive somehow. But overall, I think that might really be fun. Just increase our magic attack, possibly, and increase our attack speed. Yeah, okay, okay. Now, with our lifesteal and all, we are still pretty healthy. Things are working out for a change. Things are actually working out for a change. <laughs> Recovery and lifesteal. Ooh, but minus vitality. That's not good. Um, I think I'm going to just... Yo. Okay, let's do it like this. Okay, just for now, more lifesteal. What are you? Dodge chance, luck. No, thank you. Ooh, upgrade one weapon to the next tier. Yes, please. And the one we are going to upgrade is probably this one. That was a stupid idea. Because now I can combine these three when I could just upgrade one of the blue ones to purple. That was definitely a stupid idea on my part. <laughs> Seriously stupid. You know what? Screw it. Um, what are you again? When consumed. Oh no, that's the... No, thank you. Uh, ice wand would be fun. Don't get me wrong. Move speed resource gain. Ruby staff. Adjacent media weapons gain bonus. 1% damage for each 4 magic power. Our magic power is 23. That's plus 5% damage. That's not bad. Yeah, so now instead of having, I think, two blue ones, a purple one and a gray one or something like that, now we have two gray and one purple. Not a great idea. Didn't really do that. Like, didn't really think that through. Can't really reroll. Just takes too much. But yeah, we still have a lot of these... of these uh, weapons... They look still they still look really cool. They just, Yeah. I just could have done it better and had better ones. I think yeah it's 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 really a good idea to upgrade the lowest ones. It's always a better idea to upgrade the stronger ones, I would guess, right? Because lower ones are easier to upgrade 
or cheaper if you can find them. So yeah, I kind of messed up, but hey, whatever. We are still, we're living. Are we living the good life? No, we're just living the life. Or at least mostly living a life. Still, I, I like the... Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I like the combination of just magical range. As well as... Uh, wow. Uh, magical range as well as melee. That's just a pretty cool. That's really bad. Whatever. My fault. Okay, do I have three? If I were... Let me think. Everybody, please let me think. If I were to do something like this, there is no way for me to put another one of these here. Oh! I can also... I can combine them. Could combine them for a few rounds now. Yeah, kind of my bad for not realizing that. But alright. But alright. Lifesteal, minus 2% damage. Can live with that. Minus item prices. Don't really care for that right now. Give me something with armor. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. How would we get this one in? Oh, that's pretty easy even. Not necessarily as easy as I thought. <laughs> um, I do have five here, so I can put this in. I would need to sell something with two. So either, yeah, let's get rid of the lifesteal thing that I just bought. Doesn't really matter. Give me this one. Uh, why did I do that? Damage minus resource get, ooh. You know, that's actually not bad. Because we have so much plus resource gain that minus 2% is really no big deal. And we get plus 9% damage. We have minus 4% thanks to... No, wait. Minus 2 because of this one mirror. Whatever. Let's lock it for now. Let's think about it next, next time. I really want to upgrade the fireballs. But for that, I would need to find another blue one, I think. Plus, have somehow have the uh, the space for it. That's the biggest problem. That's always the biggest problem of this game. <laughs> but I mean, that's that's basically what this game is built around. So yeah, if you were to make it easier, then the whole game would kind of lose its purpose. Although, again, for something like upgrading, I would prefer it, but again, would make it easier, would make it... would technically take a little bit of its purpose away. I would prefer it, personally, if I could upgrade stuff with an item that I've put outside for now. Because I still have it. But then again, everything has to be inside of your inventory, so... Again, yeah, I, I, I get it. I understand. But still. Okay, let's... Buy this for now. Can we get something with more damage? Like, somehow. I mean armor. Okay. Put this here, put this there, and upgrade this time one of the strong weapons, right? Yeah. Would probably also be good to upgrade the magic staff or something, but just the crimson rip here, it sounds a bit stronger like that. Lifesteal 37%. That's a lot. Okay, do we want to reroll for something? Yeah, let, mm, definitely want to do that. 
And we're gonna upgrade... Uh, do we just upgrade another one of these? Or do we upgrade the magic staff now? Or another dagger? Wait, what's the big difference? The damage, of course, is different. Jason Weapon has 20 and 25% trigger on life. Okay, mm, wouldn't be bad. Nah, let's just make this one stronger. One damage every 15 kills with this weapon. 15 kills is not a lot. But I have so many other weapons. Probably not the best. Okay, that is another blue ceremonial dagger. I don't have the space for... Oh, but... Oh, wait, 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 wait. There it is. Okay. Okay, let me think. We need four and one. Like, four in a line and one. How do we do this? I need space now. Can't really get rid of a whole lot. I can, like, sell one item and put another item outside because I really, really want the fire wand upgraded. Uh, four and one. If I were to put this down here, this over here. Yeah, okay, that works. <coughs> Combine these three. Boom. Uh, put this one down here. Don't have the space for it, but I do have now. Uh, for now, we're just going to buy this one. And there it is. The next fire staff. That's what I was looking for. Uh, hmm, don't want to sell this one. One, two, three. No, one, two, three, four. Yeah, I, I need to do... Mm. Don't want to get rid of this. Okay, let's see. No, no. Minus... Plus enemy amount minus move speed. That's not good. No, no, no. More attack speed would be good. What do I get rid of? What do I get rid of? I think... Wait... Wait a second. If I were to put this up here, I would just screw it, sell this one, buy this, sell this one as well, and keep going. We're once again already 40 minutes in. I, this game takes a while, or it's mostly my planning that takes a while. The game itself is much or like it, it would be much faster if I didn't have to think so much. But then again, once again, that's pretty much the, the idea behind the game, right? All right. Also, I don't blame anyone who plays my videos at 1.25 or 1.5 percent, uh, uh, no, 1.5 times speed, especially a game like this, because you still see what's going on, but it's just not nearly as long. <laughs> Though I also appreciate people who play the video uh, uh, slower, because then that means for me, I get more watch time. That's actually how that works. All right, we are living, we are doing good. We are, we are doing all right. Our damage is great. Survivability so far, pretty all right. Just do this so that I can Play some little things around. All right, there's another fire wand that I can't do anything with as it stands right now. Plus, it's also a gray one, so in order to upgrade that, yeah, there's nothing. Magic power, projectile power, don't need that. I mean, the, the attack speed is not bad. Lifesteal glove, just 5% lifesteal. That's pretty cool. Another blue, blue, another blue dagger. That's good, because now I can combine these three. And suddenly I have two purple ones. 
Nice. What are you? Philosopher's Stone. Minus vitality plus 10% resource gain. When taking lethal damage, consume two Titanites. Ah, no thank you. No thank you. Me power, magic power. And once again, for every adjacent weapon, the bonus increases. Yeah, I think something like this seems the best, I guess. All right. And with that, we proceed to the next floor. I think weapon-wise, we are pretty much... We're good. Like, the laser beams are amazing. We thin out some of the enemies with our fireballs. And everything that gets too close just gets, like, six blades. Right? Something like that. So overall, I feel like we are well equipped. Still feels like we, we take way too much damage. But again, that could just be me. That could just be my playstyle. And we didn't really, like... We are on the lookout for armor items, because we do get more armor. But it just... It, it feels like it just doesn't... The game doesn't want to give me any armor items. Or maybe that's just me. Uh, what do we do here? I don't know, something like this, maybe. Don't really have a clear idea. I think that much is apparent. Okay, another fire. Ooh, another lifesteal. I'm gonna take it for now. Yeah, this one, like I said, we, on we don't have the space for it, is the problem. Uh, this one, on the other hand, we definitely have the space for, because now we can combine three of these for a blue one. Now we have blue, purple, red. That's pretty cool. Let's see what else we can get. Okay, okay, let's think this through. All I need... Damn it, that doesn't work. Um, wait. If I were to do this... It works. Now this one has one less. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's it's pretty much that easy. It's that easy. Boom, we have another magic staff. If we were to... If we were to find another one. Like so. Wait, combine two? Do do magic weapons only need two? I was not aware. Nobody told me. Okay, I can't right now because I don't have the funds for it. Oh, but that's good to know. Wait. No, but you need three. Is it maybe just a starting weapon? Because everything else... Yeah, I can. Everything else needs three. Huh. If anybody who watches this knows, let me know. Yeah, more lasers. You know, more lasers, less problems. I really need to see to it that I place the daggers in a way where they hit as many of the staffs as possible because I want more lifesteal on kill with them because the lasers are or arcade beams or whatever but let's call them lasers they are deadly okay yeah I dashed in there because I wanted the invulnerability thing thinking it would activate immediately but no it has a little like wind up until it hits me basically 
Okay, some food would be nice. Nope, we don't. We have enough uh, life steal. That's all right. So so far, I feel like in this game, I don't. I haven't played the game a lot, but I feel like life steal is pretty much one of the most important stats in the whole game. Because no matter which class I play, it seems like it comes down to life steal. <laughs> okay, let's think. If I were to do something now, no, no, it's it's better to hit multiple weapons with this one. Okay, crit chance. Oh, thank you. Dodge chance, crit chance, minus life steal. No, thank you. I kind of really want another one of these. But I don't care enough right now. Let's combine these two. And buy this one. Why don't we? Ooh. Could we make space somehow? Yes. Nope. That's only four. We need five. If we were to... Oops. If we were to put, let's say, this here, we'd need to get rid of multiple things is the problem. That is a problem. I kind of really want to keep the lifesteal. Like I said, so important. These things, really good. They don't have any negative thing for me. The resource gain, I don't necessarily care. Ask for it. Let's keep it for now. Yeah, screw it. Keep our money. That they went down easy. Like they they seem they seem pretty tough, but like three lasers at once. Just I think that's just it, more damage than any of these can handle. Period. <laughs> I think, I have, I have a feeling that our fire staff, st fire staffs are pretty much our weakest weapons. Like overall, because all the melee weapons, they just trigger in melee range, that's, but they also have good bonuses. The fire staffs, they hit multiple enemies, so that's pretty good. Damn, that was bad, that was bad. They hit multiple enemies, so that's pretty damn good. But they don't really do a whole lot of damage. And the burn damage, like, our lasers kill enemies instantly. There is, or almost instantly. There's no need for burn damage. I'm not sure. I, I, I do have a feeling that maybe we should get rid of our fire weapon. Okay. With that, we now have enough space for this. Kind of really want, but it's hmm. Nah, it's not the time. Also, vitality for each adjacent sword. We don't have any swords. Dead recovery, magic power. I see. Let's keep that for now. Maybe we'll we want to take it. What are you? Legendland's crown, media power for each two recovery, magic power for each two recovery, and projectile power for each two recovery. Recovery effectiveness reduced to 25%, not by 25%, but to 25%. Damn. Lifesteal dodge chance. Ooh. That's actually pretty dang good. Oh no, HP reduced to one next. Yeah, no, no, thank you. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Everybody hold on. Hold on to the edge of your seats. Let's combine them. For one, count it, one red dagger. And now I kind of really want another dagger. Ooh, Skimitar tier four. Chance to spawn a blade of air when attacked, dealing 59. That's... Pretty good. Do we have the space for it in any way? If we were to get rid of one of our fire wand, yes.
That just sounds fun. <laughs> also, it's a tier four already. So, yeah. Let's reroll one. <laughs> More resource gain. Another Skimitar, but... Nope. Yeah, screw it. Let's gain more resources. Okay, floor 18. So with this, three more floors. 18, 19, 20. My goodness, this is getting close to a one-hour episode again. I really would like... Okay, yeah, the scimitar is awesome. I would really like to make, like, faster or smaller episodes of this game. I really do. But it just doesn't work. I don't have, like, I'm not fluent enough in this game to know all of the items. So I really, I do have to, uh, I do have to read more often. But still, we are doing, we're doing well. Everything's working out. 17 seconds left on this. Yeah, we are, we are good. I think by now we really don't have any problems anymore. Another invulnerability item. Unlocked some stuff. Okay, I want to connect this here. Yeah. That's awesome. What do we have here again? Magic power, minus attack speed. Don't care. Definitely use this. Upgrade another item. And the up item I want to upgrade is, I think, this one. And then we combine these two. I will wait to combine these because I kind of want... Ooh, 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 just armor. Finally, just armor. Magic power minus crit chance. What are you again? Recovery magic power. Minus lifesteal. That's pretty cool. Not gonna lie. Okay. Let's see. Fire wand. Why was I under the impression that it is better than it was? I, I, I thought I saw some like blue sheen behind it, but nope, nope, I didn't. Okay, I got. I mean, I mean, sure. Okay, now we're only down to two lasers. I mean, they are now stronger than the. Then the third one, or rather we had like three different tiers of lasers, now we have the same tier, but only two of them, but it is the stronger tier, so I think that is, oh, whoa, 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 I thought we could dash through there, but no, but yeah, I mean, look at our lifesteal, look at that, I, things are looking good, we only have to survive one more floor of this. We are at floor 19. At least I think that with higher difficulties it's still floor 20 as the last one. I could be wrong. Awesome. Okay. That's some enemy swarm. Holy shit. Took some damage just to get the uh, invulnerability. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, oops, that was not the best idea. Whatever, it works. Kinda. Okay, okay. Yes. Um. Combine these two. Buy this one. It's a blue one. Blue is good. Blue is great. Did I say blue? Wait, if I were to upgrade something else, I mean, I could upgrade this and then have, but also, you know what? Yeah, that's a good idea. That is a good idea. Now we combine these three by the blue one. Scimitar, what's that again? Resource gain, but minus range. No, don't care for that. Spear. 14 range for each adjacent weapon. Damn. It's only one in this case. 
But if I were to switch these around, adjacent magic power items. Ah, but I need that. Hmm. Okay. Let's keep it like this. And we don't have any money anyway, so let's go into the last floor. Okay, there we see. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. Interesting. That's just a, a, a blade lord or whatever. That's just someone with a whole lot of swords. More swords than I have. I am slightly jealous. Not about the size of the swords, just the amount of swords. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, I want to be in, uh, uh, invulnerable and then keep close to him, I think. Oh, that's, that's a really cool boss. I like this design. And it makes a whole lot of sense just to have someone... For, for a game where you just want as many weapons as possible, to have someone with as many weapons as possible as a boss. Yeah. Okay, we unlocked more stuff. This is a great run. Even if I were to lose here. I mean, we are definitely winning. But even if I were to lose here, that is a great run. Holy shit, leave me alone or I'll definitely gonna lose. <laughs> Yeah, it's the laser. The laser that did it. Whew. Difficulty 2, floor reached 20. Awesome. I just want to see what we have unlocked. <gasps> the wizard! Magic power plus 10, minus 10 vitality. Magic power modifications are 33% more effective. Midi power and range power are 100% less effective. So you can't get anything but magic weapon. Yeah. Uh, this one will be my laser guy. Priestess, plus 10 recovery, plus 1 recovery for every 100 enemy killed. Cannot use lifesteal, plus 1 revival. Ooh, that sounds fun. There are no restrictions on weapons, which means if I were to go for weapons that get stronger the more they kill, with the class they get stronger the more they kill, that's pretty cool. Ooh, the warlock. Magic power modifications are 10% more effective. Plus 5 vitality, plus 5 magic power. Can only use enchanted weapons. Plus 50% damage over time. Ooh. This game is awesome. <laughs> like, seriously. Thank you, nerds, so much for watching. Uh, consider subscribing if you haven't already. And until next time, I'm the Renegade Cactus and I gotta run. Bye-bye.